Let's have a look on IT trends. Let's have a look on the Gartner hype cycle. Simply to check if these uh, prognoses of Gartner become true, I have taken an old one, the Gartner hype cycle of 2012. So let's check which of those uh, technologies which should become valid within the next five to ten years or two to five and five to ten years so all the blue sports are um, nowadays available and maybe not even uh, interesting anymore because it's nowadays technologies a quick look through the shape of this technology hype cycle so here we have the time yeah. This is relative, this is not years, it is relative to the invention. And here you have the expectations, so how, men, how, how people talk about these things. And then we have these different phases. First one would be technology trigger, something is discussed in the academia. Then you have this peak of inflated expectations. Then it's when things show up in normal newspapers, when things get uh, very interesting for the broad um, people, for everybody. But then you realize getting it to run, getting things really to work in everyday life is, uh, requires lots of effort. And that's this trough of disillusionment. And then slowly things start to get interesting again but now it, they are not as they are interesting anymore the expectations have uh, leveled down simply because you're used to it and you don't expect anything uh, in addition and finally you leave you have this plateau of productivity where things are so normal that you do not discuss it anymore so let's go through a um, few of those cloud computing Yes, we're using it. Yeah, you can uh, normally use uh, cloud space somewhere in your iCloud or in uh, OneDrive. Um, you can use not only this platform or infrastructure as a service, but you uh, get offerings like software as a service for Microsoft 365. Gesture control, you have it on your iPad. So if you move with your fingers, things uh, up and down. NFC payment, near field communication. This is, for example, when you pay with your smartphone. Yeah, so you keep it close, near field, you keep it close to the machine in the shop and then payment is done. I don't actually know all of these things, but here, BYOD, bring your own device. That's what we're doing in our, our uh, exam. You bring your own laptop, your own tablet, and you can work on it. 3D printing is now used um, quite often. There's jobs, there's things you can order. HTML5 is for a long time the standard in the web. Um, big data is used. Do I have more? Um, yeah. Again, I do not know all of these things, but uh, yes, probably they are in use. Let's have a look on the Gartner hype cycle 2017. And now at least those things which are uh, should become valid two to five years later are um, can, can be double checked. So uh, it's interesting, for example, blockchain when it comes to bitcoins is something we are using. Deep learning and machine learning is something we are using. You can see it, for example, in ChatGPT. But some other things have failed so far when it comes, for example, to commercial drones. Uh, I don't see it. I may see in drones in the military, but not in the everyday use when it comes, for example, to delivery services. So some of the prognoses have become true, others not.